Hello, uh, David Ibarda. Hello. Hi. Um, so we today are, or tonight, it's pretty late at night already, um, gonna demonstrate the hot hand USB, um, in working with a Max MSP patch that I made, um, in this past few weeks. Uh, and so we're going to demonstrate with you a couple of things that I have uh, got the hot hand USB uh, working with the Max patch to do. So long story short, um, if any of you want to know more details about this, feel free to private message me or uh, shoot me an email or video request, whatever. But I, long story short, I got the hot hand into Max MSP via MIDI signal. Uh, I used a few objects to get the MIDI numbers into the actual program that affects the parameters of the uh, um, effects that I put, uh, that I made in the program. So uh, the I made two effects that are um, affected by the x-axis of Barda's hand here um, and by the y and z-axis, which are uh, through the hand of that. Um, and so what we're going to do is I'm going to be playing my guitar and while the lovely Barda here kind of demonstrates the hand movements. And so these hand movements, the way, the reason why I'm not playing them on guitar is because I'm writing a piece right now, um, where this could be done, uh, with a dancer or with any other theatrical component, um, to a piece of music like that. And so, uh, with that being said, we're going, uh, I won't be in the picture most of the time. I'm going to let him take the whole frame because he's just much better looking than I am. But, uh, <laughs> uh, we are going to demonstrate, uh, the first effect that I put in, which is an effect that has a pitch bend on my guitar playing with a very subtle delay. So you'll hear um, me playing a tone and be like, dung, 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 like, you know, your typical delay sound um, with a pitch bend. Um, depending on how uh, intense his hand turning is, also def uh, affects how many cents the pitch bend. So I have it to an ambitus of 10, and a half cents, which is between a minor seventh and a major seventh, like a quarter tone, uh, neutral seventh of sorts. But anyway, so if you were to put his hand all the way like that, then we would hear that full range, but maybe just like turning it to three o'clock, you know, you may get like a tritone out of that or something like that. Something, something like that. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let's, uh, without further ado, Let's um, show them how this works. So right now I have about a 60-40% uh, dry signal with a wet signal. Wet signal being the effect, dry signal being without the effect. So I'm just going to play a really simple uh, arpeggio, major ar D major arpeggio, uh, while you do your magic. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that was effect number one. <laughs> 
Okay, so effect number two is, uh, this is a bit more of an abstract one, and props to, and I'll put this in the description of, uh, to all the Cycling74 users um, throughout all the lovely forums that I have kind of uh, got this idea from, but it's an effect where I have um, melodies that I play from a guitar, just chords, and um, through uh, a certain bend in... Um, the hot hand where it works off the x-axis so if like a finger bends um, to this angle or higher it freezes a note so to say so if I'm playing uh, here let's just demonstrate that real quick I'm gonna play one note on the guitar uh, one two three four one and obviously I'm not playing the note with my hands anymore but because he triggered this effect with um, the MIDI thing, the note sustains, so that way I'm able to play notes on top of that sustained thing. Um, in contrast, if the finger goes down, it takes off the sustained note. So now we'll demonstrate to you. Um, I'm gonna... Um, have him freeze a whole chord for me, but I'm going to play the chord note by note and the whole chord's going to get frozen and then I'm going to play a short uh, melody on top of the sustained harmony. So essentially this is melody turning into harmony, um, which we'll demonstrate that for you right now. So. said those are the effects that I uh, have made with a hot hand again if uh, any of you who are watching this video uh, have any questions or even want to see um, any versions of my patches obviously I don't have this uh, video pointed to my computer screen or anything but if you want to see any screenshots or uh, have any insight to that just feel free to message me and a big thanks to David Ibarra for being my model okay have a good evening Thank you, YouTube.